We always hear this term other people's money. And one of the things I say, well, if you've got money yourself, you need to be investing that first before you get other people's money and become a master asker. Ask people, Hey, do you know somebody that might have some idle funds, some IRA, 401k personal funds that they would love to deploy earning market rates uh, instead of 0.0% in their bank account? You know, quick question, just to talk to people, asking people, do they know somebody that? And using other people's money can leverage your business dramatically because now using the skills that you've learned, for example, finding deals in real estate, you've used those skills. Now, if you just had the cash, you could do that deal yourself instead of flipping it out to somebody else. And one of the things I love to do is the buy and hold strategy to be able to hold on to properties long-term and produce income forever. And that's certainly something that can come from what I'm sharing with you.